Giants facing the Dodgers. It has been a disappointing season for the defending World Series champion, and yet their biggest rival has clinched the NL West. So good times right now for Los Angeles. Alongside Jonah Carey of Grantland.com, former Major Leaguer Doug Glanville. I'm Adnan Verk. Doug, you look at this matchup right now. Ricky Nolasco and Barry Zito. Zito finishing probably his final season with San Francisco. But what's the mindset right now for the Dodgers and maybe Nolasco in particular? Well, the Dodgers just can't take anything for granted. I mean, for starters, you just want to make sure you get to the postseason healthy. But on one end, they have to play these games through. And, and this rivalry is going to help them sort of be wake up, recognizing that they're playing the world champs and they're playing a team that struggled all year. But you have to finish it out. And Alaska has been a nice addition for the most part. I think they, uh, they recognize it. So now it's just keeping that momentum so they're hot going into that postseason. Nolasco, in fact, one of the best acquisitions at the trade deadline, and the thing about him was always had great strikeout-to-walk ratios, which tends to be a great predictor of success with pitchers, but his ERAs weren't that low. He didn't win that many games. Now it's all working out. The peripherals and the surface stats are catching up to each other. It's been great for the Dodgers. It's our final doubleheader of the season. Raise Yankees 7 Eastern and then fall by the Giants and the Dodgers. We'll see you then.